Okay, so always very hard for me to, to try and tell you what this sounds like. And you know, on the demos as well, you're listening through a recording that I'm making. Um, but take my word for it, the D-Rack Advanced Bass Control makes a difference. Depending on the room, easier, that room was way easy. Did it once, it worked, two THX subs, it worked. Having the four subs took me a bit more time. When you guys are calibrating, make sure it's quiet. Um, here by me, it's a zoo, it's never quiet. Guys are working, kids are running, dogs are barking, cars are revving. Um, and then when, when I wanna calibrate, when it's like everyone's gone home and my son is at karate and my wife's taking him there and the dogs are relaxed, then the birds think, now it's like, G -g -g -g, they start chirping everywhere. So the only time I can really calibrate here when it's quiet is late at night, but then everyone's sleeping. And I'm guessing all of us have the same problem, but eventually I got some quiet time, got a calibration done. A DR calibration is not quick. It takes at least an hour to two hours of your time. Okay, guys, so I did actually decide I'm going to make a separate video of this. Um, I've been playing around for a lot now so doing I had a problem where my heights were um, <clears throat> rattling the ceiling too much so they are symmetric set six and five so what I did is I dragged their crossover higher I flattened the curve out so it is not boosted like the other one so if you look at six um, 120 hertz there's a crossover point there it will show you on top there as well yeah you can go and look at what's been done to the graph so it's pretty flat um, as opposed to if you look at for instance um, the fronts that will be the Harman curve we did and this will be what the um, base control has done. Um, again, you can see what it is like. Original. And then what's been altered. Um, this crossover point, D-Rack sets at 70. I'm happy with these. I'm going to leave it as is. It's just the heights that um, were just too overblown in base. The speaker could handle it. My ceiling could not. Um, I'm also going to be doing the Moran Cinema 40 um, in the Clips THX room in this video also um, with the advanced bass control. Guys, I almost feel like I should do a complete video just on this. Um, so this is the bass control that I eventually I'm getting to grips with now. And it is calculating what all the subs are doing. Group 1, front, left, right, center optimizing symmetric groups um, I'm gonna load this file up now and see what difference we get okay so now we are implementing the advanced base control on the THX system there we have our subwoofers Again, just so you can see everything that it's doing, the different crossover points that D Rack has set. Surrounds. I do not agree with this one um, at 75. Just want to have a look. There, there. So I know my ceilings, so I will drag this. Where is that? 140. Yeah, about there. So drag them. France, we have 70. Center, 70. Surrounds. It's weird that it made these different. But I'm going to go over it and see what it does. Um, base control. And then we calculate. This takes a while as you can go going through all the different frequencies, setting it all up. 
and then we'll see what difference this makes on the THX room um, and we're doing the Bowers room as well at the same time um, this is a, a direct live pace control day okay so let's start with the first preset we go direct live we go A1H flat so there we go um, I am going to demo the same section on the disc I'm not going to drag it out too long just give you guys a whole nice little feeling here and I'm going to go to reference volume okay let's go this is Dirac flat Okay, second one, let's go Dirac, 10 dB curve. I just realized the faster way to switch over between these modes so instead of going all the way to setups just do options Dirac live and there we have it flat 10 db advanced base so here we're going to go advanced base this help you if you are still on the fence with Dirac just do it the normal package is good the advanced package is just better um, so depending on how serious you take this game I will leave it to you guys until the next video please like subscribe share this far and wide see you next time cheers